Thanks for coming to our 61st City Council meeting. If uh, everybody will stand, our uh, brother Don is going to say a prayer and then we'll go into the Pledge of Allegiance. Will you pray with me? Father, we thank you tonight for uh, this city. I thank you for all the workers uh, that go work through day and night uh, through this town and make this place what it is. Thank you for the citizens that uh, put their time and effort in making this a great place. I just want to thank you for the blessings that we have. Father, we ask that you be with the meeting tonight, be with the council members as they make decisions, grant them wisdom that only comes from above. And we pray this all in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, call to order the um, Guthrie Public Works Authority. I will, uh, we have the consent agenda, or actually do we have any community announcements? No, no one's. Nope, okay. Signed up. Uh, we have the consent agenda, items A through G. So moved. Okay. Second. Okay. All right, we have a motion to uh, approve items <laughs> A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. Everybody else vote. So moved. <laughs> okay, we just display the votes for us. Okay, it's unanimous. We've got uh, five voting members here. We've got uh, Trey, the vice mayor, is out today. And, of course, I'm obviously not the mayor. So the mayor's <laughs> had a, a little bit of a minor surgery today. So I'm... Uh, I'm third in line, so that's why I'm up here. All right, thank you. Let's see. I would uh, accept a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. Okay. Cast your vote, please. I'll well, make a motion for that. All the votes are in. So moved. All right, just play the board. <laughs> okay, oh, who's. Sorry. All right. <laughs> <laughs> it's a difficult job ahead. <laughs> Wrong, well, we're, we're <laughs> almost all all unanimous there. Okay. <laughs> you can stay around. <laughs> all right. Take a lap. <laughs> all right. So, he likes public works too much. I, he doesn't want yeah. to. Leave. I'll call the city council meeting to order. We have a pretty large consent agenda tonight. We're going to pull items L and items N off the consent agenda. And I'll open up for a motion to approve. Uh, should I say Miss Mayor? I move. <laughs> Miss Acting Mayor? There you go. I, I move uh, to pass the consent agenda from A through you. K. Is it K? Because it's L. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then from M, and, M, and then uh, O through U. Second. Okay. Second. Okay, we've got our second. Go ahead and cast your votes. All the votes are in. Okay. Display the board, please. All right, that passes unanimously. And now we're on to, uh, let's see, I will step out on this, and Wanda, you can cover okay. for me on this one. Okay. <laughs> Item A is to consider approval of the agreement between the City of Guthrie and the Guthrie Chamber of Commerce for the purpose of encouraging, promoting, and fostering tourism in the City of Guthrie to be funded by the hotel motel tax receipts. Any questions? Entertain a motion. So moved. Second. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you know the script? <laughs> <laughs> Can I ask one quick question? Yeah. Um, isn't this the agreement we've always had? Yes. Okay, so there's really no change in it. No then. change. Mm -hmm. Okay. But it's no just an annual all. agreement. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. All the votes are in. <clears throat> I would just play the board, please. <laughs> I'm not used to this job. <laughs> well, you better start getting <laughs> Okay, on item N, John's got a conflict on that one, and he'll step out. Juan, do you want to? 
No, you can do it. Can I do it? You can do it. Okay. <laughs> Unless you want right. me to. <laughs> the item in is to consider approval of an agreement between the City of Guthrie and Logan Community Services Incorporated for a temporary shelter for the juveniles. So moved. They have a second. All right. We have a second. Let's cast our votes. All the votes are in. Okay. Display the board. All right. Passes <laughs> unanimously. Okay. We are uh, next up for resolutions, item number three. You want me to handle that one? Yes, please. Can you okay. tell us about it? Yeah, resolution number 2012-13 is establishing a fee for waterfowl hunting at Liberty Lake. Um, on August 1st, the Guthrie Park Board met and reestablished the waterfowl hunting at Liberty Lake. And on September 12th, the Citizens' Rate and Fee Advisory Committee met to discuss to establish a fee for the waterfowl hunting at Liberty Lake. It was the consensus of the members present from the Citizens Rate and Fee Advisory Committee to set a fee at $400 per blind, which four people are allowed at each blind. Okay. We have a, do we have a motion for approval? Um, Ms. Acting Mayor, I move <laughs> that we approve resolution number 2012-13, establishing a fee for waterfowl hunting at Liberty Lake. Okay. We have I'll a second. It. All right. Let's cast our votes. All the votes are in. Okay. Display the board. Thank you. All right. Passes unanimously. <coughs> All right. We have another resolution for a FFA, FAA grant. Yes. Wanda, yep. you've got all the details. Yeah. A resolution number 2012-14, accepting the FAA grant offered for airport improvements for project number 3-40-00-36-13-2012 at the Guthrie Edmond Regional Airport. Uh, Friday, September 14th, we received notification from FAA that we were approved for a grant that was submitted on June 25th. The grant includes the rehabilitation and reconstruction of taxiway C, construction of northwest development area taxi lanes, and to rehab runway lighting, the PAPI wiring. The FAA requires that they be notified of the approval and acceptance of the grant by a resolution adopted by the governing body. And this is the resolution that's being presented tonight. Okay. I just have a quick question. Mm -hmm. As far as um, the airport with the Edmund Guthrie situation i know in capital improvements we're supposed to split at 50 50. have we had issues with edmund not paying their part of the other half their mm. half of a capital improvement no never okay thank you okay i'd entertain a motion for approval so moved okay we have a motion. second okay and a second everybody cast your vote all the votes are in okay show us what we all right we're approving that resolution now we're city manager's report. Yeah, I, have, I have nothing to report. I've only <laughs> been here for a short period of time. <laughs> okay. You're doing a good job, Wanda. Thank you. We had a, we've got a really big agenda, and it's, it, it should have been big last uh, yeah, two we weeks ago we and not this week. Last one. Yep. That's right. <laughs> okay. Then I guess we'll do our city council comments. Sherry, you want to start? I don't have you ready? Any. I actually don't know. Really? It's all... I'll just forfeit my time for you, Mary, because okay. I know you'll have lots of things to well, say. Well, there's not too much going on this week. You had a couple things, so. How about you, Patty? Uh, I'd like to mention the fact that uh, the Blue Bill is now going to open on Wednesday night, the 19th. Uh, we're finally going to have a family restaurant, mm -hmm. a new one, mm -hmm. and I encourage everybody in town to be sure and go by and try it out. It's going to be steak, chicken, and catfish. And they'll be open, their opening day Wednesday, they'll be open from 11 to 8. And then Thursday uh, is 11 to 8, Friday's 11 to 9, Saturday's 11 to 9. And they're also going to be open on Sunday after church, 11 to 3. So I hope everybody in town gets a chance to go by and try it out, take your family, and then have a, have a good family outing there. Because uh, we're lucky that uh, uh, Larry Ladd uh, has a wonderful building there, and it's now rented, and we're going to have... A neat new place to go to. That'll be fun, fun, fun for everybody. Um, just a quick note. Uh, I didn't make it to the 6 o'clock meeting because my I have a 15-year-old cat that meant the world to me. 
and he's dying tonight. And we all go through that in life. But you know, it's really wonderful to have a chance to say goodbye to him. And I know we've all been there and done that. And I just appreciate the vets that we have in town that kept my Georgie Kitty going all these years. And, and uh, I feel for anybody that goes through that. But thank you all very much. Okay. Z, what's going on down there? What's going on down there? I don't know if I'm by myself. <laughs> you feel lonely today. <laughs> um, just uh, wish the mayor a quick recovery. And uh, we got Blue Jay homecoming this week. Yes, so we do. They're looking good on the football field, I think. Looking mm -hmm. pretty good. Yep. Um, so. Parades at 2 o'clock. Is that what it is? Parades at 2 o'clock on Friday. Yep. Go out. Yep. Game starts at 730. Do it. Yep. And the band sounds great, as always. Mm -hmm. John? Um, all I have is, uh, I guess, yeah, the mayor. I hope he's feeling better. Um, and I hope the former mayor, John Gummerson, is, uh, continues to improve. Um, that's quite the situation. So that's all I have. Okay. Well, there's a few things going on. Tomorrow there's a circus that's going to be arriving in town tomorrow morning. About 9 o'clock they're going to do... Uh, to driving their stakes and putting up the tents and giving tours between uh, 9.30 and 10 tomorrow down at Cottonwood Flats. And the shows, they've got two shows. They have one at 5 o'clock and one at 7.30. So come on down. You can get your tickets down there if you need to. You can get your tickets at the Chamber of Commerce. Um, we have a uh, economic breakfast on Thursday that is going to be really good. It's at the Holiday Inn Express. It's really early in the morning. It's at 7.30, but we've got a gentleman that's going to speak about um, about uh, oh uh, money going out of the mar help me out Cody uh, <laughs> leakage thank you he's going to speak about uh, leakage going out of the county so I think it'll be a real good uh, breakfast to go to uh, let's see Bank First is having a customer appreciation on Friday so they're going to be real busy stop by there put your money in the pot and maybe win a hundred dollar gift card is what they're going to give away and we still have, well, actually we have a, the Guthrie Wrestling Booster Club is going to have a co-ed softball game out at Owens Field on Saturday at 9 o'clock, and this is a fundraiser for them. So if anybody's interested in playing softball, you can go out there and check them out at Owens Field. And then uh, next weekend, the 28th, 29th, and 30th, the Lazy E will host the Oklahoma Department of Wildlife Conservation Expo. And then, of course, the week after that, once we get into October, we've got our two main festivals, which the mayor would probably be talking about tonight, is the Bluegrass Festival, which he uh, does a lot of work for the Bluegrass Festival. That'll be going on the 4th, 5th, and 6th. And then the um, Guthrie Escape will be that Saturday and Sunday. Right in the downtown area, they'll have a couple of blocks blocked off, but they'll have art, wine, and music down there. There will also be the Pollard Theater going to be showing the 39 Steps, which is a new play they have. And then Guthrie Haunts uh, Scaregrounds will be open in October the 5th through the end of the month. And that's out north, uh, out on Old 77. And I think that, oh, and there will be a zombie run on the 6th too. It's a zombie bolt. will be from 4 to 6 that Saturday. So... I think they've got a lot of runners that are going to be, and a lot of zombies are going to be involved in that on Saturday. Should be interesting. So, hey, don't forget Vince Gill now. And Blue Vince Bits. Gill will be here, absolutely. Oh. Vince Gill will be bringing in a large crowd on the on the 4th, 5th, and 6th. I think he's going to be here on Saturday, yeah. playing on Saturday yeah. night, the 6th. So um, go on out. And I think Mayor's giving tours, actually, through the some of the Bluegrass Festival. Should be pretty interesting. If that is it... Um, let's go to item number seven. We're going to consider convening into an executive session. Does anybody want to make a motion? It would be actually number six. Seven. Uh, seven on I believe it's amended. seven on the, oh, on the amended, amended agenda. agenda. Okay. I don't mm -hmm. have the amended. Let me do seven. It. All right. Go for it, Yeah, I move that we are uh, going to executive session pursuant to authority of Title 25. Oklahoma Statute 2001, as follows, Section 307B1, for the purpose of discussing the employment, hiring, appointment, promotion, demotion, 
disciplining or resignation of public officer or employee, city manager, and the same thing for B, for the city attorney, and C, for the city judge. Okay, second. All right, we have a second. Let's cast your votes. All the votes are in. Okay, display the board. All right, we're out to our executive time. session. You already know, though. <coughs> Sorry, David. I heard it first from you, actually. <laughs> <laughs> don't know why we're telling. Don't know why we're giving you a press now. No, he didn't hear you. I said, "Sorry, David." <laughs> are we? Are we back? <laughs> okay, we are. We're back in from. We are back from executive session. Oh crap! I would uh, entertain a motion. Uh, uh, yes. On item eight. I would make the motion that we. Uh, Follow the contract for hiring the city manager, Serena Breland. I would second that motion. Okay. A motion and a second. Cast your votes, please. All right, Wanda, show us the board. All right. <coughs> Unanimous vote for our new city manager, Serena Breland. Yeah. I think everybody, you know, <laughs> she's a really sharp lady, so I'm excited for everybody to meet her. I, I think she's going to be a great addition to. Uh, Guthrie and everything that we're doing here. So yeah. she's going to be able to pick up right where Matt left off. Absolutely, sure. absolutely. Now, right, will friends. she be here through our next meeting? Do August, we, October twentieth, no? I think. Is that correct? Yeah. Okay. I so in October she'll be here. October. That's great. That's why I've been told. Right. I think that's what Trey told me. Good deal. Super. Okay. Okay. Item number nine. I'd so entertain a motion. I'll make a motion that we uh, renew the contract with, and with the changes for our city attorney Randall Shadid. Okay. Second. second. All right, we have a second. Cast your votes, everyone. All the votes are in. Okay, Wanda, let's. All right, unanimous again for our city attorney. Congratulations, Randall. I appreciate it. All right. And I would make the motion that we renew the contract for city judge David Hood. And Judge Hood's here. I think everyone knows Judge Hood, but yes. David's yeah. here. In the, okay, anyone second. want to second that? Anybody all right. Traffic Patty? tickets they want to talk about. Everybody cast your vote, please. <laughs> All right, Wanda, display the board. That, once again, is unanimous. We have unanimous counsel. All right, congratulations, David. Thank you for a great job you're doing for us. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. We appreciate it. Yep, we do. Okay, uh, motion to adjourn out of city council. So moved. All right, to see. Second, Second on. Just adjourn. Right. Yeah, you don't. All the votes are in. Okay, Wanda. Just adjourn. Thank you, that's you, unanimous. You could just adjourn, actually. We have one more. I know I could have, huh? You gotta get used to that power. I that you do have. have to get used to that. <laughs> okay, now we also have our uh, special Guthrie Industrial Development Authority. Hold on, I use the gavel. Call it to order. <laughs> um, we have a consent agenda. Do we need to pull item B? We had someone that was going to speak today, but they are not here. She left. If not, we'll just go ahead and just go on. Go. We'll move for approval for items A and B. So moved. Second. Item B, Mayor, in the write-up shows that Bill Myers, Myers Engineering, is going to be hired as the, the uh, engineer on this infrastructure project. That needs to be made part of the motion on B. Who's he going to Okay. It's in the write-up. So, so we need to pull it? No, you can do if you just add that. Okay. So moved. So added. Okay. <laughs> All right. You, go. you got that? Okay. <laughs> then let's go ahead and cast our vote. Okay, display the board, please. All right, that's a unanimous. Thank you, Council. Mayor, maybe just for the public's information that this uh, is strictly a GIDA loan and it is paid solely from the corporate hangar lease payments and the hookup corp and the utility hookups to those corporate hangers only. No other lease payments of any other hangers go to this, no other obligation whatsoever. If these hangers never got built, this loan would not be repaid and it's not an obligation of the City of Guthrie Public Works. And they couldn't come after the idea. Well, that's good. Great. Thank you for that information. Okay, and we will not be going into executive session on this, correct? No. Item, uh, we can go to item four. This okay. is the, uh, you authorized me some months ago to obtain a lawyer in Colorado to pursue our judgment uh, against XL Jet. Uh, I have found a law firm that's come, or, uh, come highly recommended, and uh, I'd like to, uh, you'd authorize me to hire. <coughs> 
and I thought I brought the contract, but I didn't. It's Dana Treadwell, and she is. Uh, she will do this for a 35 percent contingent fee. Before you gave me 30, 30, and a third percent. Uh, I think this is a good deal, given the fact that she's going to have to do work and doesn't know whether there's any assets there with which to recover anything. So uh, we'll pay the court costs. That'll be a minimal amount, and. Uh, We'll go from once she gets XL Jet and finds out what their situation is, then she'll report back to us, and we'll decide then whether we want to go against any other entities. Now, if they sell that whole concept to another town like us, we we could jump in there and get money from them, right? Yes, we could. Okay. Okay. So we need a motion to for consideration. So moved. Okay. Second. Have a motion and a second. second. All right. Everybody, cast your vote. All the okay, Wanda, display the board. All Actually, right. Councilman Hazelwood, we could, I could do that under the Oklahoma judgment if, if that happened, and I sure wish it would happen. <laughs> yeah, it would be nice, wouldn't it? I'd love to go would be to nice. their bank account. Yeah, <laughs> it sure would be. Okay, great. Well, I guess it's time for us to adjourn. Let's do it. All right, we're adjourned. Let's go home. <laughs>